There's art. Um, how are you? Um, so there's been a lot of people um, in the group wanting to know if we can use the this little piggy pigments and um, other techniques. So today is just a, an experiment. This is the first time I've tried to use them in a Dutch pour. I have used them in a tree ring pour. And um, hold on, I'll show you. Um, they actually, like, it turned out really pretty. I don't know if you can see it. Hold on, let me see. This was just an experiment, too. It's not that great. Um, but I actually kind of like it. <laughs> but um, And this was used with the um, Shelly Art recipe, all house paint. Um, no flow draw, no water, no glue, none of that all, none of that stuff. Um, so today, um, I've already got my paints mixed up. I use like, um, for my two paints, I did 15 grams of Floetrol. I did five grams of paint and I did two grams of water in each of the two paints. For my pigments, I used um, like 17, 18 grams of Floetrol. I used about, um, half of a teaspoon to a teaspoon, not even a teaspoon of pigments, like half of one of these spoons, like half of that. And hold on, I'll show you. About this much. Um, I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, about that much. Um, and one of them, I did not disperse the pigment before, and I wish I would have because it's this purple right here. I did not, and it's not as like bright as it should be. Um, and I did with the other ones and they're a lot brighter. So I've got my um, white mixed up right here. I just need to stir it. This is gonna be my base coat. And I mixed that, um, it was 90, 95 grams of Floetrol, uh, 35 grams of paint, and no, hold on, and 20 grams of water. Please bear with me too. This is my first video and I'm extremely nervous. Let me, um, I'm going to flood the canvas and I'm going to fix my camera so y'all can see really good. Um, here is the, um, the consistency with the little piggies. They're really fluid, but this is about how you would want it if you were doing a Dutch pour. So, all right. Let me move these out of the way. And what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to do, um, I'm going to flood the canvas. Hold on, let me fix this real quick. Okay, that's better. All right, so I've got everything set up. Um, and I think what, I, what I'm going to do is I'm going to flood my canvas. And then, here, I'll just show you. Oh, Happy New Year's, everybody. I'm sitting here painting. The husband's out there making me some cradle grounds. And my dog's trying to get in to my painting room. I won't let her. Okay, all right. Let us uh, flood the canvas. I probably should have put gloves on. This is an old canvas too, so I'm just using it to practice on. Hopefully this turns out pretty. We will see. I 
I have a little squeeze bottle. Hold on. Let me put this here. We're going to do the edges. a little bit more. Let's see. Okay, I got my edges covered. Okay, does it look, can you guys see okay? <laughs> I'm asking you like you're in the room with me. Uh, this would be much easier if you guys were. Like I said, first time, please bear with me. Um, okay, let's, uh, let's start with purple. We're going to go... like that and then we're going to lay um i'm going to lay the purple pig i forgot what it's called it's laying really nicely and it mixed really well um into the flow trawl um yeah so now we're going to do um a little bit of sangria or is that right yeah. Yes. All right. Um, and then I'm going to lay a little bit of this crimson. Um, maybe a little bit more right here. Okay, and then uh, I'm going to lay, this is, tea, or, guys, I don't know all the colors, so I'll, I'll put them in the description. This pretty one. All right, and we're going to put sapphire. I do know this one. Okay, and then um, this is Artist Loft Metallic Cobalt Blue. All right, now I'm going to grab the torch. Make sure I torch all the air bubbles. Yeah, please bear with me. Okay. All right, now I'm going to put a little bit. Okay. All right, cross your fingers. Okay. Thank you. 
It's actually really pretty. Let me give you a close-up. Hold on. I'm going to have to practice. Um, I might have to mix, hold on, like a, a little bit of um, some of that gloss gel into the pigment. So, um, like it has a little more body. But let's check it out. Oh, wow, it's pretty. I'm not sure. What do you guys think? Should I keep it? Oh, hold on. Yeah. Um, I don't think I mix some paint very well. Yeah. This is just a practice, but what do y'all think? Please let me know in the comments. If you like it, um, if you want me to keep practicing some more with the little pigments, I think it turned out lovely. Hmm. Look at that. Okay, guys, um, thank you. Um, please like, comment, subscribe, and um, I hope you guys have a lovely and wonderful Happy New Year.